Hey everyone, it's Kai Another Kaiism, and in the video this week, I wanted to talk about aggression versus compassion. Well, what made me think about this is that my husband and I are a are big fans of the show Riverdale, and Riverdale is about Archie, um, Archie comics, and um, it does a little bit more of a a modern twist to the Archie comic characters like Archie, uh, Veronica, Betty. Well, there was a scene in the episode that we just watched where there's this young boy that's hiding in a gym cubby and there's Archie and there's Josie and they op- Archie and Josie open the door to this cubby and they see this young boy and Archie's response is, hey, what are you doing in here? And then Josie's response is, hey, what, what are you doing? How do you feel? And the difference was that Archie started his communication and his surprise through aggressive communication means while Josie started the conversation through compassionate means. And even in my own dealings in life, I definitely feel like I get a lot further with people being compassionate to their plight and my own plight um, in comparison to being aggressive. And, um, you know, especially when dealing with my child who is still a toddler, um, it's hard sometimes. She can be frustrating. She can really kind of push the limits in her behavior and in her words, that it's frustrating. And as a parent, as a person, it's easy to want to respond back with aggression um, to show that frustration. I try to respond back with compassion because she's only two. She's also a person and wants love and attention and affection just like all of us human beings on earth. We just want that. And you get a lot more bees with honey than you do with vinegar, as that saying goes. And, you know, when those moments of frustration come up, when the moments of frustration arise, I really try to step back and show compassion versus aggression or anger because I know that I'm not going to get very far and I'm not going to feel as good if I respond back in a, in aggression. Be bold, be brave, be compassionate. Always. We all have phobias and with the be bold hyphen be brave dot com website, my affiliate sites are strictly geared towards phobias, things like fear of flying, of social anxiety, and there are more to come. So go ahead and check out those affiliate sites for some help on getting over your phobias. Hey, it's Kai here. If you have five minutes in your day, even less than five minutes, don't forget to click subscribe. And you can also see more of my videos back to back to back by clicking to see more. Be bold hyphen be brave dot com. Always.